Hello children, today in this video we are going to do our exercise 12.2. But before starting that exercise, few things should be clear to you. First is complementary angles. Now two angles are said to be complementary if their sum is 90. It means if we will add two angles, the sum should be equals to 90. If we will get 90 as a sum, then the two angles are called complementary angles. Second is supplementary angles. The angles are said to be supplementary if their sum is 180. Again, if we will add two angles and we will get 180 as a sum, then that two angles are known as the supplementary angles. Now, to the exercise, exercise 12.2. Find the complementary angle of 34 degree. How to calculate the complementary angle of any angle? Of the given angle, we will subtract the given angle from 90. So, 90 minus 34 is equals to 56. Complementary angle of Y, 90 minus Y. Complementary angle of 13 degree, 45 minutes. So, 90 minus 13 degree, 45 minutes. How to subtract? It is easy for you now. 90 degree, 0, 0 minutes minus 13 degree, 45 minutes. So, when I will take one borrow from here, it will be 1 degree is equals to 60 minutes. So, 60 minus 45, 50 minutes, 15 minutes. And here, when I have taken 1, 89 will be left over. So, 89 minus 13, it is equals to 76 degree. Complementary of x plus 40 degree. So, what we are going to do now, see here, this carefully. 90 minus, in the bracket you will write x plus 40. So, open this bracket, 90 minus x minus 40. 90 minus 40, 50 and 50 minus x will come. Next, 27 degree, 8 minutes, 54 seconds. So, 90 minus 27 degree, 8 minutes, 54 seconds. Subtract it. I have taken one common, one, I uh, will take one borrow from here and what will be? It will be 60 seconds. Here it will be out of 60, only 59 will be left and from 90 it is 80, 89. Now, 60 minus 54, it is 0, 06 seconds. 59 minus 08, it will be 51 minutes. And 89 minus 27, 62 degree. Second question, find the supplementary of 123. In complementary, we have subtracted the given angle from 90. In supplementary, we will subtract the given angle from 180. So, 180 minus 123, 57 degree. Supplementary of x plus 118, it is 180 minus x plus 118. Open the bracket, it is minus x minus plus minus 118. So, 180 minus 118, it is 62 minus x. This will be your answer. Next is third part, 145 degree 34 minutes. So, 180 minus 145 degree 34 minutes. 180 degree and 0, 0 minutes minus 145 degree 34 minutes. Here it will be 60 minutes and here it will be 179 degree. 60 minus 34, 26 and 179 minus 145, 34 degree. Next, 110 degree, 23 minutes, 45 seconds. Subtract it. You will get 60 seconds minus 45, 15 seconds, 59 minutes minus 23, 36 minutes and 179 minus 110, 69 degree. Last part of this question, 2x degree plus 70 degree. So, supplement is 180 minus 2x plus 70. 180 minus plus minus minus plus minus. So, 180 minus 70 is 110 minus 2x. Third question, find the complement angle of not 2 by 3 of 60 degree. So, 2 by 3 of means multiply and 60. When you will cancel, you will get 20. 20 into 2 is 40. Now, we have to calculate the complement of this angle. Complement means 90 minus 40 which is equals to 50 degree. Second part, 3 by 5 of 20 degree. So, 3 by 5 into 20. When you will solve, you will get 12. Again, we have to calculate the complement of 12. So, 90 minus 12 which is 78 degree. 1 by 4 of 44. So, 1 by 4 into 44. 
you will get 11. Complement of 11 is 90 minus 11 which is 79. Fourth part, 20% of 50 degree. 20% means 20 upon 100 into 50. When you will solve, you will get 10. So, complement of this is 90 minus 10. It is equals to 80. Next, find the supplement angle of 4 by 5 of 150. So, 4 by 5 into 150. When you will solve, you will get 120. Supplement means 180 minus 120 which is equals to 60. 30% of 120. 30 upon 100 into 120. Solve it. You will get 36 and supplement is 180 minus 36 which is equals to 144. 11 by 12 of 180. 11 by 12 into 180. Solve it. You will get 165. 11 15 is a 165. Supplement of this is 180 minus 165 which is 15 degree. 70 percent of 100. So 70 upon 100 into 100. 100 100 cancel 70. Supplement of 70 is 180 minus 70 110. Question number 5. Two complementary angles are in the ratio 4 ratio 5. Find the angles. Now children whenever ratio is given to you you have to write some constant. Let that constant be x. So let the angles be 4x and 5x. Now what they have given you? Complementary angles. Complementary means the sum of these two angles will be equals to 90 degree. So 4x plus 5x is equals to 90. So here 4 plus 5 is 9x is equals to 90. x is equals to 90 by 9 which is equals to how much? 10. Now we have to find out the angles. Angles means we have to put the value of x over here in 4x and 5x. When we will put the value, the angles will be 4 into 10, 40 and 5 into 10, it is 50. Question number 6. Two supplementary angles are in the ratio 5 ratio 7. Again the same thing. Angles be 5x and 7x. But here it is supplementary. It means 5x plus 7x is equal to how much? 180. So 5 plus 7 is 12x is equals to 180. x is equals to 180 by 12. It is 15. Angles will be 5 into 15 and 7 into 15. So these are the two angles. Next, question number 7. Two complementary angles differ by 40. Their difference is 40. So find the angles. I will take first angle is equals to x. And second angle because they differ by 40. So second angle will be x minus 40. Now what they have said? Complementary angles. Complementary means x plus x minus 40. So x plus x minus 40. Complementary it is equals to 90. Shift this 40 towards here. x plus x 2x. So 2x is equals to 130. Or x is equals to 130 by 2 which is 65. So first angle will be x and second angle will be 65 minus 40 which is 25. Next question, question number 8. The measure of two complementary angles is 3x plus 8 and 4x minus 2. Find x. Now two complementary angles they have given you. These are the two complementary angles. It means when you will add these two angles it is equals to 90 because they are complementary. So 3x plus 4x, 7x, 8 minus 2, 6, it is equals to 90. 7x is equals to 90 minus 6. 7x is equals to 84. x is equals to 84 by 7, which is equals to 12. So we have to calculate the value of x only. Ninth question, the measure of two supplementary angles are 3x minus 7 and 5x plus 27. Find both the angles. First angle is given to you 3x minus 7. Second angle is 5x plus 27. They are supplementary. So when you will add them what we will get 180. Solve it 3x plus 5x 8x minus 7 plus 27 is plus 20. So 8x plus 20 is equals to 180. 8x is equals to 180 minus 20. 8x is equals to 160. And x is equals to 160 by 8 which is 20. So first angle is equals to 3 into 20 minus 7 and second angle 5 into 20 plus 27. By solving you will get 53 and 127. After this last 
question of this exercise find the value of the angle if its supplementary angle is 2 by 3 times of it we have to find the value of a angle but the supplementary of this angle is 2 by 3 times of it so let the angle be x and supplement of this angle will be 180 minus x now what they have said supplement of the angle supplement of the angle means 180 minus x is is means is equals to 2 by 3 2 by 3 of means multiply it means angle angle is x so 180 minus x is equals to 2 by 3x shift the term of x towards this side 180 is equals to 2 by 3x plus x take lcm 3 is the lcm here it will be 2x only 3 divided by 1 is 3 multiply by x is 3x shift this 3 towards here cross multiply 180 into 3 2x plus 3x is equals to 5x so when you have to calculate the value of x we will shift 5 down over here 180 into 3 when you will cut you will get 36 so 36 into 3 is 108 so angle is 108 so thank you children and complete this chapter in your notebook